welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going on another toy hunt. Right now, we're actually at a Walmart. We're going to hit up two Walmarts and one Target, I do believe. And there's somebody parking right next to me, and then there's a person to my right that's in a car, and the person in front of me is in a car, so I'm going hardcore on the phone right now, man. I am just, I, this must be the most emphasized phone call of all time, I'll tell you, but the camera's sitting right there on my dash, staring right at my face, so I mean, yeah, it, it's probably, it, it probably looks like I'm filming some skit, which I am, but you know, I don't, yeah, I feel pretty damn awkward right now, Brad. Jesus Christ, like right beside me. Yep, yep. Super awkward right now. Christ on a bike. It's like 3,200 people out right now. It's it's 7:40 a.m. It's 7 a.m. It's 7 it's 7 a.m. Why do we have, Why is there so many people out right now? 7 a.m. Four or five people around me right now. There's plenty of parks in the parking lot, and I think this person parked too close. Anyways, guys, we're going to go inside this Walmart, see what the hell they got. I'm not looking forward to too much. You know, they may have some AEW Series number three. They may have some Elite 82 would probably be the best case scenario. I'm really, I, I, you know, I don't have high hopes for the area. I feel like my area has been dry. I feel like the last two or three toy hunts in this area, you know, when we're back home have been just, you know, the, you, you guys see the chair footage. You see where we beat the hell out of the chair. You guys know what the hell's up, but I'll see you guys on the inside and we'll see what the hell's going on. All right, guys, let's see what we got right here. Uh, I mean, not not atrocious. We got Mae Young in the house. We got the collector's edition. First time in a while, Mae Young. I, I, dude, I swear this figure follows me everywhere. I swear this figure follows me follows me everywhere. I've seen it so many different times before, and I still haven't grabbed it. But as far as basics, I mean, we got first time in the line, Tegan Knox. I remember her mock images. People were crapping on that figure. We got Humberto in the house. He looks good. White white attire. Got the good head sculpt in there. I don't know. I'm not a Humberto fan, but I may grab it. You know, you never know. You never know. I like the white elbow pads. You got the Chase variant as well. I think I think this is the Chase variant. It may not be. Really need that coloring book attire Big E in an Elite, but Braun Strowman in the house. Not a bald head sculpt. You got Becky Lynch with a good head sculpt. I recommend getting that and putting it on your Ultimate Edition if you want to do that, but... The rest of the stuff, it looks like they just have what? Basic Series 115? Basic Series 115 and pretty much just Mae Young. You got the belts, you got the Wreck and Slam Cycle with Undertaker. We did a full review of that on the channel. But outside of that, I mean, what else do you have, man? Got some other stuff, non-WWE, no AEW, nothing like that. So, I mean, I don't, I don't know. Tegan Knox. I like the knee braces. Like, the knee braces are solid, you know. I just wish the basics had the old articulation. Humberto, maybe a pickup. I'm trying to decide, get my thoughts together on what I want to grab here. May Young, follow me around every John Brown. I feel like I could use that trophy as well, maybe, for a potentially thing. But anyways, on to the next one. All right, guys, well, we just got out of the first store. We went to the first Walmart. Now, the first clip, I may reshoot it. I may not. I, I, I don't know. I'm kind of worried that the car was still on when I recorded it, so it may have got effed up. You guys saw where the... Well, you may not have seen it, but there was like 62 cars around me with a lot of people in it, but we just left the first Walmart. They had a decent selection, you know, Basic Series 115. I don't know if I've seen people find that in stores yet. I I feel like they, that it's been in stores for a while now, actually. So I, I guess you guys will find out what we grabbed at the end of the video. I've seen that May Young, like, 64 times like I've legit seen it like at least three or four times so I don't know that Mae Young's been chasing me around I don't know like every store I go to or every Walmart at least that I go to I swear I see that Mae Young I wonder when we go to my other location I wonder if it will be there as well but parking lot's pretty stranded now it's like I'm, I'm like way back in the thing I should have recorded the intro right here I may redo the intro right here I don't know I'll just have to go back and listen hopefully the engine's not too loud or something like that maybe I can noise cancel some of that but anyways guys we're on to the uh, uh. anyways guys we're on to the next store I think we're gonna hit up Target. Hopefully they don't have garbage, but uh, let's go find the hell out. All right, guys, we made it to our second location. Let's go in here and see what the hell they got. Oh, oh my God. What am I, Sub-Zero? That's better. Anyways, wait, it, uh, anyways, let's go in here and see what they got. You know, my boy John, I think, came here yesterday, and I think he said they had jack shit, so probably going to be jack shit. Let's find out. All right, guys, let's check it out right quick. Oh, my God. God in heaven, Brad. I mean, what are we doing? What are we what are we doing? One Becky Lynch and a Braun Strowman, just like the Walmart, just like the other Walmart. Basic Series 115, Braun Strowman and Becky Lynch in the house. But the only thing I can really say is at least that Miss Elizabeth's gone. You got one SmackDown tag title, and that's pretty much it. I mean, that's literally the only thing we can really say is that thank God Miss Elizabeth found a home, man. She got out of here. 
she found a home, but there's no other figures in sight. No AEW, no Royal Rumble, no Elite 82, but that means they'll restock. Hopefully they restock. The lighting right here is god-awful. Anyways, got a little something special going on there, young man. Anyways, guys, we're at the second Walmart. We're going to go in here and see what the hell they got. I mean, Target, what they have? They didn't, I mean, they did not have a something special. They, they, they did definitely didn't have a lot of something special going on. They didn't have anything special going on. They didn't have anything at all going on. Nothing that's special, non-special. They didn't have nothing. They had nothing going on, young man. Anyways, let's go in here and see if we can find some ish. They had AEW figures the other day. Maybe we'll get lucky again. I'll see you guys on the inside. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's find out what they got. Oh, my God. All right, well, we got an AEW figure. We got an AEW figure, AEW Series 3 Unrivaled Pac figure. Now, this is probably one of my least favorite figures they've made, just simply because I didn't give them boot rotation. But look at her. Mae Young making her return, man. What, a, what do you think about that? Braun Strowman, top talents. AJ Styles, top talents. Uh, Finn Balor, top talents. It looks like we got uh, AJ Styles. Ooh, Monday Night Messiah. Lana action in the back there. Mae Young following me around. One championship showdown pack and belts. Lots of belts. But AEW Unrivaled Collection Series 3 Pac. I mean, that's a pretty good find. I think I'm, I've found one, two, and three so far. I've found every series at least once at retail. So I'm hoping that this Walmart will be like the staple for finding AEW figures. Hopefully they get every single series because they've been consistent so far. Love to see that. But uh, they have a ton of these title belts. Jesus Christ. But Pac is a pretty cool find. Mae Young still follow me around, man. Shaking my head. All right, guys, we're back home after the toy hunt. You guys can see here, this is what we got. So let's go ahead and take a look right quick. So the first thing that we got was I went ahead and got the Mae Young. You know, like the lighting's terrible. What is that? Anyways, I went ahead and got the Mae Young. You know, uh, again, she's she's been following me around. So I figured, you know what, Brad? You want to follow me around? Get RKO in the pick fed. So that's what we got for her. Next up, guys, what did we get? We also got the white version of the white attire, Humberto Carrillo. And the reason I picked this up was because, you know, I don't have a Humberto. You know, I figured you might as well add him to the roster. Maybe we can convert him into an elite. I'm not a big Humberto fan. However, this is a sick-ass white gear. I, did, I couldn't remember if this or the red version was the chase. I thought the red version was the chase, and there was two of those. So I figured, you know what, I could always go back and get one. I doubt that they will move, so we'll have to see about that. We'll just have to, you know, play that by ear. But it also comes with two white elbow pads pads, which I thought was, you know, that could be useful. And then the last figure we got, guys, is going to be the Tegan Knox figure. Now, I'm not a big fan of this figure, but I figured, you know, you got to expand your women's roster every time they release a new women. Every time they release a new woman. Every time they release a new woman figure or women's figure, you need to go ahead and grab it. So I went ahead, added her to the collection there. And if you guys are wondering where we are right now, this is actually, I don't know if I've showed this off before. I don't know if I've put this on the channel just yet, guys, but what you're looking at right here is the, this is going to be where the My Damn Nation arena goes man this is where it's gonna go right here i have my full mock aew figure collection and some other mock figures down here so i figured i would leave Pac at the store you're probably wondering why i didn't grab the Pac figure i figured somebody out there is looking for some aew figures or a Pac, or you know what i'm saying and i already have one mock and one loose i figured somebody out there is looking for an aew figure and they may want that Pac, and they may need that Pac. so i went ahead and did that but right here guys this is the my damn nation arena this is the prequel up there those figures will not be there this is going to be completely re hold those belts are going to move obviously we got a lot of you got yeah you, we got a lot of work to do here but while i'm filming other shows i figured i had to go ahead and knock this portion out so i made a custom built table and this ish takes up a lot of the room so you guys know we used to film right there right like we used to film all my videos right in this area well now i've had to move the filming station down this is where i do all of my uh any thumbnail shoots you know i got all my figures right here i put all my lighting right here and you guys know like when wrestlers get their like championship promo picks and stuff. Got my white background right there so that I can get a good clean shot of the figure and cut it out easily, make my thumbnails, stuff like that. My Damn Nation Arena is being built right now, and yeah, I mean that's, uh, I mean we got a lot more ish to cover right here, but we got time. We got some time as we work on the other shows, but that is gonna do it for the Toy Hunt, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy AEW Revolution tonight. Who's freaking psyched? I'm ready to go, man. Ready to see the show. I will review it for you guys, so stay tuned for that tonight. If you guys are purchasing AEW Revolution, definitely come back for the review tonight. We'll cover all the 
good-ish, and we'll get it started, guys. But if you guys are wondering how long this table is, it's four by eight, so four feet wide, eight feet long, but then we connected it to my other table. That way, uh, we could extend it if we need to, and I'm gonna be probably feeling, I don't know. I, uh, I've already spilled too much beans, man. This is probably the last shot you'll get of the arena until we do the arena tour. But I'm getting the hell out of here, guys. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. God in heaven, where's the random shout out? So this shout out is going to go to TEW Wrestling. I can't wait for Revolution. This show should be amazing. Love the content, MDT. Keep up the great work. Huge shout out to TEW for that comment. Man, I really, really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for stopping by, checking out the channel, and checking out all of the good things. I hope tonight's show is banger, but I'm getting the hell out of here, guys. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel, and uh, don't cross the line, Brad. You cross the line, I've been